A downtown rainbow crosswalk defaced again. Pretty disappointing, frustrating uh, to see. The hate crime unit is now investigating. CTV Calgary, local breaking news with Brenna Rose. Good evening. Calgary's new Pride Crosswalk downtown has been vandalized again. Police are now investigating today's incident as a possible hate crime. The words, quote, shoota, followed by a slur were written on the Pride Crosswalk on Stephen Avenue near Center Street. The vandalism was spotted by a few people this morning. One man took a photo and posted it to Twitter to raise awareness and let everyone know that this is not acceptable. Some people tried to wipe away the words before a crew arrived later to properly clean it. Police were called and the incident is now under investigation by the CPS Diversity and Hate Crimes Unit. Hopefully we're able to see whether it's if there's cameras around or we can start to see that um, people who do these sorts of things are actually um, brought, uh, brought to justice for it. Um, to hopefully send a message that if you do something like this, that it's not okay and that it won't be accepted. Nolan Hill says he's disappointed and frustrated someone would deface what's quickly becoming a landmark in Calgary with lots of people posing for photos on the crosswalk. The vandalism comes just four days after someone spray painted the words lost and lust on the pride and trans crosswalks. Investigators are still looking for tips from the public in order to make arrests in both incidents. Calgary's pride parade is scheduled to take place on September 1st. Meanwhile, in another Calgary neighborhood, diversity was being celebrated in a big community project. Volunteers painted a pride crosswalk at the intersection of McDougal Road and 9th Street Northeast. The idea was community driven to show support for everyone in the LGBTQ community. About 50 volunteers took part to make it a reality. We're just really happy to celebrate our, our neighbors and the diversity of our community and make it a continually uh, more welcoming space and add some, some fun and color to this intersection. So. The costs are being covered by a sponsor, Doodle Dogs, a dog project store in the neighborhood.